Hey foodies, welcome back to Neeta's Indulgences. Today we are on a food adventure to explore Rahmania biryani in Ambur. Let's unravel the magic behind their mouth-watering biryani flavors. If you are a biryani enthusiast, then you are in for a treat. So, what are we waiting for? Let's crack on with it. I am in Ambur in North Tamil Nadu and I am here to taste the Ambur Biryani from the famous Rahmania Biryani Hotel. Rais Ahmad represents the third generation of the Ambur Biryani tradition. We are going to watch the making of the legendary Ambur biryani here, the mutton biryani right from scratch. Some refined groundnut oil goes in first. Some spices will go in with it like cinnamon, cardamom along with cloves. Copious amount of onions going into that hot oil with the spices and onions will be cooked till it's nice and brown. Generous amount of garlic paste along with the rock salt goes into it. Once it's nicely sauteed, master added ginger paste. Then he adds the Kashmiri chilli paste which they have ground. There is a beautiful colour after the chilli paste is dropped in the vessel. Now goes in large amounts of tomatoes. A mix of coriander leaves and mint leaves are added to the beautiful gravy. Fresh mutton pieces are added to the vessel. This is a male goat which is under 10 kgs. The colour of the gravy is basically from the chilli paste and tomatoes. Now goes in homemade set curd. Master cooks the mutton for 20 to 30 minutes. This is the siraga samba rice which is soaked and cooked for 10 minutes. This half boiled rice is added to the delicious mutton gravy and it is skillfully stirred without breaking the mutton and rice. Now we are at the final stage of the cooking of the biryani which is the dam and master is keeping the coal on top so that it's evenly cooked. This place started in 1890 and it's a popular biryani place for all the biryani enthusiasts. So now we are going to taste this biryani. Uh, what I see from here is it's jiraga samba rice, uh, the short grain rice. So let's try. Okay, moment of truth. The mouth is actually watering. Huh? Very simple flavours, but so flavourful. I think you all should come here and try this biryani. And chicken is also very soft. I'm not able to touch it because it's piping hot. As the aroma of the delightful biryani from Rahmania lingers in the air, it's time to bid farewell to the busy hotel. The city outside was doing its usual thing cars honking, people rushing, but I was still reminiscing the flavour of the Rahmania Biryani. Wow, what an incredible experience it was here at Rahmania Biryani shop. This opportunity to meet the team and the making of the biryani was something that I will always remember. If you find yourself near Rahmania Biryani shop, 
then do stop by and treat your taste buds with this yummalicious biryani. If you have enjoyed the making of this video, then don't forget to hit that like button and do leave your comments in the comment section. Until next time, happy eating, take care, bye-bye.